Hey guys, we're here to demonstrate your extra burnout workout. Okay, so this is your super quick, intense workout. Jamie's gonna start with a one minute jump rope. She's gonna show you the low impact version first. Okay, so she's got the jump rope in her hands. She's tapping her feet and she's swinging it side to side. Okay, obviously the quicker she goes, the higher her heart rate's gonna get up. She's gonna show you now the high impact or the more advanced version, which I think you guys remember from grammar school. Nice, if you wanna make it harder, you'll go quicker or increase the height of your hop. Okay, so she's gonna go one full minute. She's getting all fancy on you now. And when she's complete that one minute, she's gonna stop. If you can, try to take as little rest as possible. If you need more recovery, take 15 to 30 seconds recovery and then come back. She's gonna go to burpees next for one full minute. Good, this is the low impact or beginner version. Hands go down on the floor, pushing the legs out and then standing back up. Okay, this is called an up down. Now she's gonna show you the full burpee. Nice, she's gonna go all the way out with that push up and then stand all the way up with that hop. Again, she's gonna go for one full minute and then she's gonna stop and quickly move to the next exercise, which are mountain climbers. So she's gonna place her hands down on the floor, staying in that plank position. She's gonna alternate driving those knees in. If you notice her front foot stays off the floor, the lower impact is just really slower. She wouldn't add a hop, she'd just alternate driving those feet in. Again, that's for one minute. When she's finished that, she's either gonna take some time to recovery, recover, or she's gonna move into her plyo squats. The modification, if you need the low impact, is just some squat pulses. So she's got her heels loaded, she's got her hands above her heart, working hard. If you're more advanced, you can add that plyo squat. So when you're doing this, you're thinking about how many can you get in that one minute? Okay, when she's finished with those, She's going to either take 15 to 30 seconds recovery or she's gonna go right into her skaters. We're gonna show you the low impact first. Okay, so there's no hop. She's pushing that foot back behind her on an angle. Her knee is staying right over her ankle and she's focusing on those outer hips. The more advanced version adds a hop, like she's skating or skiing. Obviously, the wider and the higher that you go, the harder this is. Last but not least, when she's finished that, she's just gonna go jumping jacks for one minute. And she's gonna keep breathing and smiling. And that is your extra burnout workout.